Alright, welcome to the 2020 Otis Halloween season. Just want to give you a short intro to it, to welcome you, to kickstart kick these two months of Halloween that we celebrate here at Otis. What it is, what the Otis Halloween season is, is basically the Otis website comes alive. It resurrects itself, oddthingsiveseen.com, and every day there is new content that's always spooky, or fall, or Halloween centric, and it could be anything from uh, article about a spooky site that I visited in the past or the present. It could be articles around TV or movies or Halloween candy or just my thoughts around Halloween. Just a lot. Halloween. It, it's the, I'll type that word a bazillion times in the next two months. Um, it's also diary entries. I'm still doing the diary this year where I kind of recount on a daily basis more or less what I'm doing in the season. Um, I, I enjoy doing that a lot. And podcasts. I'll do a podcast or two that is that is spooky and relevant as well as videos. So lots of stuff, lots of create creating going around this season. Obviously this is a weird one, the weird Halloween. And Halloween is weird by definition, but this could be an even weirder one because of COVID. But you know what? I, I'm kind of up for it. I like surprising Halloween seasons. I like Halloween seasons that aren't predictable. I like Halloween seasons that I have no idea what's going to pop up any given day. Obviously I hate COVID. <laughs> but I love kind of the challenge that COVID is throwing at Halloween this year. Um, so come back every day from today, September 1st, all the way through to October 31st. I already have on the site a, a video besides this one that is kind of a montage of the past 10 years of Otis. I cut together a bunch of footage that I took over the past 10 years of the Otis Halloween season and stuck a upbeat spooky track on it to make it watchable. Uh, so check that out. There's an article up already on... Um, a horror icon whose grave I visited in New Jersey, so check that out. Uh, if you want even more content, more Halloween content, uh, follow me on Facebook or on Twitter or subscribe to my Patreon, uh, J, uh, what is it, patreon.com slash jwoker. I do a weekly newsletter for Patreons that in September and October is completely Halloween filled. It's the kind of thing you can subscribe just for the Halloween season and then jump out, unless you do the, the newly established yearly subscription which means you're stuck with me for a year, but you do get a nice discount for doing that. And the other big thing this season, the big thing for me, is that I have a new book coming out. And it's nonfiction, which I haven't done in years. It is Cursed Objects. It comes out September 15th, which means you can um, pre-order it now, which would help me out a lot, or, or buy it when it comes out, which also helps me. Just buying it helps me at the end of the day. But look at it. It's a beautiful book. Hard, hardback, uh, gorgeous uh, metallic cover, fully illustrated. Look at that. It is the most beautiful book I've ever written. The design on this thing is way better than the content, I have to say. I mean, the content's mine, the design is the publisher's. But it is the kind of book you can gift to somebody. It looks, it's that nice. They'll be impressed with the book, even if they don't read a single page of it, they will appreciate the gift. Um, we'll do some Cursed Objects content on the blog, uh, on the Halloween season blog as well. I've got some stuff that didn't make it in the book. I have some behind the scenes stories of, of writing this. Um, so it'll be, a, it'll be a cursed Otis Halloween season, I think. Um, and yeah, that's, that's really it. I just wanted to intro you to this year's season. Thank you guys, or thank you for coming around, for following me the past few years, coming to other Otis Halloween seasons, just being around for this time of year. I know there's so much content out there today that fills our lives. A thousand streaming services and a bazillion books and all kinds of YouTube videos and websites. So thank you for making me a part of your season. I'll try not to disappoint you.